What's up, guys? Welcome back to another Geno VOD review. This time we have a special guest. All right, we have Fuebo. If you guys don't know, uh, if you guys don't stop by my channel, then you guys probably don't know who Fuebo is. But Fuebo is a great guy, a great human being, a very genuine dude. And he sent us in a VOD here to review today for you guys so I can give you guys maybe what he did wrong or what he did right, things like that. All right, I love you guys, and let's get into the video. All right. Turn the, turn the volume up a little bit here. You know the deal. So I think he's I think he's just metting here for the the first couple seconds. No, you have to take a close range fight with them, honestly. But it's going to be tough. Hey, why don't you... You guys are a black knight, right? Now, the thing I notice about this... This right off the bat, right? If you notice that their comms are on point... That is huge for a new player slash, like, new squad, right? right just, Having good comms is absolutely humongous in Tarkov, all right? Because, seriously, if you do not have good comms, then you aren't going to survive with the squad well at all, right? Yep. Player? Outside where? Like, garage? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now he notices that his teammate just died. You you hear his teammate just scream there. He notices his teammate just died, so he's gonna go straight over there and rush the uh, rush the whole situation. He's trying to get some info and stuff like that. So this, this is already, like I said, great communication by Fuebo, right? He's asking his teammates where they're at, getting intel on like where he should be and like where the enemy will be. And his teammates, right? Right. I'm so. right along the backside of Queen right now. Is that you? And he's doing a very, very good job at letting people know where he is as well. Yep. Which is yep. huge. They're over here somewhere, bud. Check on the roof. Make sure you're looking on the roof here. Oh. Yeah, they're up on the roof. Right? Oh, jeez, guys. Taking shots at me. He's up there. All right. I'm going up. He's going to be aggressing the situation. He's going up. Notices that they're on top of the roof. So he goes and decides to check it out himself. Up on the roof. Yep. Weird. I just got up here. Maybe he could have sworn he was up there. Still could be. If I had to turn below, I would be hard. I'm at Queen on the roof. So he already gets the high ground. This is huge when it comes to Tarkov. You always want the high ground, all right? Insert Anakin, you know, you have the high ground clip here. It's over, Anakin! I have the high ground! But in Tarkov, you always want to have the high ground. If you have the high ground, then you're going to be above the pack. You're going to be above everybody else, and you're going to be able to shoot down on top of them. All right? And then just simple, you know, simple video game tactics here coming out by Fuebo. I don't know where these guys are shooting me from, bud. Yeah, trust me. Oh, I hear them in the bushes, I think. Oh, I see one. So he seems to hit fire. The reason he didn't aim down sides there is probably because he's just in the, uh, the middle of a fight. He got into a situation to where he didn't want to use his uh, his sight. I'm getting shot up. I think there's a guy at dome. Can you look at dome for me? Now what he notices right off the bat is where he's getting shot at. If you just realize that he called out, I think he's at dome. He instantly knew once he was getting shot at where the guy was. That is huge. If you can figure out where you're getting shot from, you can usually take cover behind, you know, buildings like Fuebo is doing here and, or trees or whatever you can. And sometimes you're not able to be able to, like, fi figure out where the shots are coming from. But once you do, that's that's when you can, you know, win a fight very, very easily. I got one of them. Good spray by Fuebo right there. He he took control of the situation. He realized where he was getting shot from. Let's rewind that, right? He realized where he was inside the building. He knew he was in there, right? 
He didn't know where he was to begin with, but he realized where he was and started spraying towards the position. Gets him. Drops him like a freaking bag of bricks, right? Perfect play by Fuba. I think this duo is dead, the one that got DJ. Taking a little hit of the vape. Respect it. Respect it. Uh, let's just skip a little, little head here. You know, he's looting, looting and scooting. You know the deal around here. He's just seeing what these guys have. Let's skip ahead. Dropping his teammates' gear. That's huge. All right, that's huge. All right, that's huge. Dropping his teammates' gear. You know, you're just a freaking great teammate if you loot your teammates before the enemies because you can drop their stuff. You're a good teammate, Pobo. All right, I freaking appreciate you. I'm gonna jump into shit. I'm gonna make my way over. No, you're good. I can't see you. You're going now. No, it seems he's just dropping the stuff here. Let's yeah. let's skip a yeah. skip ahead here. I love how they're very aware of the situation, right? Like, they understand where everybody is, where their teammates are, where possible enemies could be, and that they're just scanning the area, right? I see a guy outside. Listen, I don't even know what that guy was fucking doing. Like, what Like what was that guy doing? I don't know, though. But he looks fucking geared But, uh, Fuebo hit him in the, uh, the left ear socket. Well played shot by Fuebo, you know, shot him where the helmet wasn't what- wasn't. Alright. Good shot by Fuebo. Takes him out. Bam. Now they realize the situation. They're freaking kitted, right? They're just, they're simply just hauling ass to get out of this raid. All right. That's all they're doing right now. They're going to go towards extraction. They got the Red Rebel Ice Pick extraction. Going to be headed there. It seems like they went in with like four, maybe, and left with two. So, you know, their squad, half of their squad died, but. It's very unfortunate, but at the end of the day, Fuebo came out with some fat loot. All right. Good raid by Fuebo. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying these VOD reviews. Let me turn this down a little bit so I can talk as well. Um, appreciate Fuebo. Great guy. Go check him out. The link's going to be in the bio. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Can't wait to see you guys tomorrow. I thank you guys so much for watching. You can catch these clips every day at twitch.tv slash Gino. We stream every single day besides Wednesdays. Yeah, so I hope that you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.